the bat hound sniffing out the best asa softball bats there are and i'm here to bring you a bat review of the monster get nuts let's put some swings on it but first here's a quick look at a product we'll be using today in my opinion the green pitching machine by pop toss is one of the best inventions for the slow pitch softball world as you can tell by the name of the product, it is a pitching machine that launches 12-inch softballs and you don't need batteries, you don't need electricity, and it comes with a lifetime warranty. My family purchased one of these for me in 2018 for my birthday and I've loved it since day one. It's a great product to have if you want more live batting practice and you don't have a pitcher to throw to you. Down below you'll notice the link where you can purchase one of these. Be sure to use my affiliate code LIVEBP and save $8. As well as if you're looking for more information, you can check out my other reviews that I've done uh, in the links down below of this fantastic product. Yeah, that felt good. Just shy there, got the pavement around 300. Nice still day uh, now. Wind is pretty, gone pretty quiet. If it is blowing, it's kind of a crosswind, sometimes with me. This is an exclusive uh, by uh, all American Athletics or A3, one piece bat, uh, ASA only or USA softball. Oh, off the handle. Special thanks to Heather Nowak for sending this one to me to try out. Uh, it's taken me quite a long time. Sorry, Heather. Uh, thank you for your generosity and letting me uh, have it and swing it and try this one out. Uh, if you're ever looking to do a, a bat deal, uh, I can recommend her, Heather Nowak. Uh, check out the graphics on these. This one, just fantastic. There's a lot going on in there. On there, looks sharp. You really got to go slow and pause and take a look at everything. Just great, great graphics. Now, here's the thing with this one. This is a mystery bat. A couple reasons why. So, if you look there, it says M3 construction. Except uh, Monster didn't do an M3, so it's mislabeled. And then this is being a one-piece bat. One second there. You can see that uh, the sticker says 25.5, uh, which that also, uh, up until this date, uh, they did not have. Right, on the scale, they can fix that there, it's 25.9. So, what is it? Well, there's two options. It's either a repaint of the Monster Sinister or the Monster Zombie slash Bombardier. Now, how do we tell? I don't really know. But generally speaking, uh, you know, the Bombardier comes in 26 and 27 ounce and the Sinister is 25 ounce. Now, an M2, uh, any, I've seen Sinisters range from anywhere from, generally speaking, 25.2 to 25.5. But I have had one, uh, I had a drop the bombs on cancer of 2020 that was 25.9. I have one at home that's a red candy sinister that's 25.8 on the scale. Uh, and generally speaking, those bombardiers weigh above the, uh, you know, especially if it's M2, it's above 26 ounces. So I don't know what it is, but I can tell you this, either way, it's gonna be solid. The reason why uh, is the sinister, if it's a sinister, that's been my gamer. Although I would say certain bats are really coming on strong like the hot butter or the Proton Smith, uh, what else at all? Oh, the, uh, the Torch Galaxy with the alloy handle from 2023, fantastic. Uh, the comeback of the 26.5, the two piece, fantastic. Uh, so there's a number of bats that are really, really trying to chase down that Sinister. Uh, so if it's Sinister, it's fantastic anyhow. So uh, we can know that. Uh, the other option, if, if it's a Bombardier, that's gonna be a fantastic bat. Now that's never been my gamer, my gamer, but I was talking with the guy that uh, introduced me to the Sinister years ago, who was totally spot on. The Sinister is solid. He told me that if I pick up a Bombardier and get enough swings on it, that he says it'll outperform the Sinister. So, 
I haven't gotten there yet, but I'd like to see it. So, uh, you know, I, I trust him. I trust his thoughts because he introduced me to the Sinister. So it could be the Bombardier, which I think would be solid. Fun mystery bat. Who knows? But it's going to be great. Come on, you nuts. Oh, I just missed that. I mean, good clacking going on there. Eh? Come on. You know, I do not see many of these at all out there. I mean, it's probably because folks get a hold of it, swing it, and they don't want to let it go. Because it's either the Sinister or the Bombardier. Come on, here. Uh, the pop toss you can adjust for up to 30 seconds, I believe it is. Oh, yeah. Sure to check out. Got that one. Badhound.com where you find used bats, merch, recommend, recommended products, and more. We'll actually take one more. Uh, I like to keep the pop toss the shorter from load to launch just for a workout. Yeah, it's feeling solid. I mean, that's clacking really good. Not all of uh, my uh, bats, monster bats, are going to have the clack, some a little bit more than others. Like here's the sensor here that doesn't have anything. It could probably use more swings. But this is looking fantastic, feeling fantastic. Fun one to swing. Might be a hard one to find, but I can recommend it as far as I know. Well, there you have it. Feel free to leave any questions, comments down below. This is the Bat Hound. Everyone signing off. Be sure to subscribe to the channel up here. Check out some other videos up here and down here. Thanks, everybody.